I feel there's a lot of sadness around and humanity tries to to hide it or revolt or just ignore it and dance around on music on Netflix and no blaming about that to go into the grief of Gaia is courageous and I think sometimes one just has to go and pass through that not to stay in there because the mother of grief cannot change the world but out of her grieving heart compassion grows and I think nature knows the grief in her own way. She knows the impermanence of things. And she also knows that one day there will be another world, a new world with eternal qualities. But for the moment, she has the eternity in her changing rhythm. And as does, reassures us that after winter, spring will come. And after summer, autumn will come. Some trees are majestic, touching each other with the bows. I heard that trees who love each other, they tend to grow towards each other. And when one dies, the other one is looking like bending towards her. It's beautiful. Even if we learn in this natural awareness training, mindfulness training, to stay in a sort of witness position, we also learn to go into a love, an aliveness inside ourselves. and outside ourself and that's the love that's the all-pervading love ah, look at this green sometimes they are obstacles or steps ah, and it gives the clue for the next next step I will end with this beautiful green Till next time.